Well, if you've watched a few of the videos on this tour, then you're fast becoming experts in the way that Jerusalem expanded out the city walls and the first few neighborhoods behind them. This neighborhood's quite similar to the others. It's the second neighborhood outside the wall, just after Mishkanot Chananim, and a little before Nakhlaot in the market, if you're going to go there next. But there's a feminine twist to it, which is a story I want to tell. So this neighborhood is called Nakhlat Shiva, the settlement of the seven. It was founded by seven men who wanted to take the future of Jerusalem and of their own families into their own hands. But it came to a halt when they didn't manage to get the bureaucratic work set out across with the Ottoman um, rulers of Jerusalem. And it ended up, as things often do, that human relations between one person and another sorted it out. One of the men was married to a woman who had been born in Jerusalem, which meant that she spoke fantastic Arabic. She spoke the right language, with the right accent, and she could personally interact with the Ottoman authorities. So she got the deeds, the neighborhood was set up in her name, and it was her local character that ended up this area, which is so nice and fun and full of its own character today.